Hello, my name is Arlette Milstead. I'm a sophomore from Council Bluffs Abraham Lincoln. And the title of my poem is Generation Y. We millennials are lucky. We can hide behind a screen and never have to show our actual emotions face to face. We can easily figure out who Daisy's new boyfriend is because of Snapchat and Instagram. If we don't want to call our name to her face, we can do it over a screen because that is just nicer. And we definitely don't have to ask you out or break up with you in person. Because why make it harder when we can just do it over text? We are socially illiterate. With technology, we have no reason to say or solve anything face to face. Why should we go outside and do something when we can watch our favorite YouTubers do over video? We think Kate Upton is the ideal body, so we starve ourselves with juice cleanses. But yeah, we love food. You can see it all over our Instagrams. We expect everything right at our fingertips because we're impatient and lazy. So yeah, we're lucky. But are we really? You say we're lucky, then call us out with every insult in the book. Do you think I chose to be like this? When I was born, I was like every other baby. I cried as soon as I came out. What's different? Touch screens? Yes, I was among the first set of many children to experience technology. And now I'm among those that can go from making a spreadsheet to playing with Snapchat, fi Snapchat filters in 10 seconds flat. I did not choose to be like this. I was born upon it. So you can't say that I'm some lazy, impatient, sad excuse for a Barbie doll millennial without saying you're partially to blame. Everyone has flaws, you just seem to like to point us out more. Why can't you learn to see that this is how we consume our knowledge? But we don't have it as easy as you may think. If anything, we have to work harder to make a place in this world with the way our economy is shaping. We may be seen as shiftless, but we will work as hard as we can for what we want. We have to. College is ridiculously out of economy's hands and our parents' bank account. And when we finally get out of college, we wait out the anticipation for an unpaid internship. So yeah, we're lazy, but we're gonna work hard anyways, and yeah, we're stuck on social media 24 seven. But did you ever stop to realize how much we are informed of today? Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram allows us to know about more shootings and more terrorist attacks and more natural disasters than we'll ever learn in school. It's not like we're dissing school. It's not like we won't need quadratic equations and knowledge of the War of 1812 for our future careers. We're just like your generation, but with a little twist named technology which you may say is a synonym for lucky millennials. All we ask in return is for you to allow us to make a choice and start a revolution with good or bad, in my case, good. And all we could ever want from you is a simple gift named respect.